At age three, I was diagnosed with asthma. And so pretty much my entire childhood, up through even into chiropractic school, I was on asthma medication. But having asthma in general affected my life because I was big into sports. I loved basketball, I loved to run. I had dreams of playing college basketball at some level. And everything was going fine up until about my sophomore through senior year of high school. And all of a sudden I just couldn't do the things that I normally could have. I couldn't run a mile anymore. I could only run one time around the track, um, up and down a few times on the basketball court, and I was winded. I was told you're out of shape. I was told you're not working hard enough. Are you lazy? You know, sports is a big thing in my life that really was taken away because of my health uh, issues that I had. And so that led all the way up through college, and I was interested in chiropractic because of the sports world. And I even went to chiropractic school um, for that reason. And it was in chiropractic school that I had a, just a life-changing moment. Um, and it wasn't uh, really a big wow. It wasn't uh, a firework that went off. It was just some, somebody just simply saying, your brain and your spinal cord control everything in the body. So chiropractic is so much more than just your neck pain or your back pain. Maybe it could help you with your asthma. There was something about it that resonated with me. Like it just made sense. I didn't need um, a research article. I didn't need somebody to prove to me that it worked. It just made sense that the body was created to heal itself and that your spine surrounds and protects the nervous system and that the nervous system controls everything in the body. So I was like, wow, what, what if there is a correlation with my asthma? And so I started getting corrective chiropractic care, consistent chiropractic care, and within three months, my asthma was completely gone. I went from about 20 years, 20 years of asthma medication to three months completely gone. And I remember for the whole next year, I used to carry around my rescue inhaler because I was like, you never know, what if it comes back? And a year later, my wife says, why do you keep carrying that thing? And I remember like tossing it out. And it was ever from that moment I knew that chiropractic was so much more than just uh, a symptom, that there's something to this, uh, something innate, something that's inside of us. Through chiropractic school then, I just became really passionate, really excited to teach people about true health and true healing, that God created the body to heal itself, and to not look at health in a pill, potion, lotion, is to really grasp First of all, the principle that you are your best doctor and that you can heal, you just need to remove the interference. And so that's why I do what I do. It's, it makes it easy for me because I've been through that, I've been through the struggles, and looking back on it, I have a lot of what ifs, but you can't sit in the what ifs. You have to say, you need to take those lessons and say, wow, that is, uh, uh, that's my story and a story of redemption and healing that we want for every single one of our patients. Every single day that I get up and that I get to adjust people and I get to teach them about chiropractic care and nutrition and, and healing, I mean, it's a great day.